Uh, my name is Mohammed Al Ani. My name is Ghazi. Yeah, you you eat it with your bare hands. Awesome. You'll be fat by the way you eat this. <laughs> oh, have no. Wait, wait. 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 <laughs> Come on. You should visit our country. Right? Definitely, definitely. Yes, you should. Okay, guys, welcome. Uh, it's the first time we're having yes. people from the beautiful country of Iraq. Thanks. And we've got two guys, uh, so it's awesome. Yeah, thanks. Uh, what's your name? Uh, my name is Mohammed Al Ani. Okay, that's great. Are you? My name is Ghazi. Okay, that's great. So, uh, are you from the same city in Iraq or you're from different city? No, we, do, we are a different city. Okay, which city are you from? I'm from Salah Haddin, especially from Samarra. Uh, okay, is it close to. Baghdad or it's yes, Baghdad. I guess near one half hour you'll visit half there. hour. Yeah, okay. uh, and you? I'm from Ambar and I live in a countryside called Haditha, the okay. western part of Iraq. All right, and we are so far from Baghdad. Okay, very far. Yeah, okay. But uh, the countryside I think is more beautiful, right? Because yes. you get to see more nature, it's calm it's and calm, relaxed and, and relaxing. Yes, no and noise, no cars passing through all the time. It's, it's a bit calm. Absolutely. Okay, that's great. Mm -hmm. So today, uh, we just want to learn a little bit more about Iraq, you know, like the food, the culture, the heritage, what okay. to do when you come there. Uh, so we're just going to learn a little bit from you guys since Thanks. you are from there. Okay. Um, okay. So, uh, what is the most popular food in Iraq, according to you? According to me? Yes. Oh, I have a lot of things of food I want to okay. test. It. Oh, right, the first great. one, the mm -hmm. first one is about dolma. Okay. You know the dolma? Dolma, yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. it's something, uh, put uh, some vegetable, put mm -hmm. them in the side, some mm -hmm. rice, some meat. Oh mm -hmm. my God, delicious. You should test it's, it before. It's really amazing. Yeah, yeah. Like, like Syrian have the mahash, you know. It. Okay. Yeah, okay. The same, but we, uh, we put in the side a lot mm -hmm. of things. Okay. Like vegetable and uh, like this. Okay, but uh, you put meat or, uh, inside, right? Yeah, we okay. should. Meat. Sometimes okay. we not meat. Uh, mm -hmm. I put the meat. Sometimes mm -hmm. just the ribs. The ribs. Ah, you know, okay. Yeah. Just put the ribs. And the okay. Cycle. This is kind of like my food. Yeah. Like a little bit of meat. <laughs> I can eat it. Uh, what about you? What do you think is the most popular food according well, to you? Uh, like I'll talk about the popular food in my city, which okay. is very popular in my country. Mm -hmm. So it is called porridge in English. Okay. okay. And we call it dlemie mm -hmm. in Arabic, Iraqi. Mm -hmm. So it is like chopped bread and mm -hmm. then you add porridge. Uh, okay. Yes, yeah, so you add broth mm -hmm. and then you mix it and then add the rice. Mm -hmm. And there are so big parts of meat in there. Okay. And there, and okay. yeah, you you eat it with your bare hands. Oh yeah, it that, that's incredible. my kind of eating. Yeah. It's I don't incredible. like eating with spoons and forks. You never me. want to stop. Yeah. So like, if you eat it at lunch, then the whole day you're just relaxing, chilling. Yeah. You don't want to go to work because you're full. You're yeah. just feeling really relaxed and. <laughs> that's right. Okay. Awesome. You'll be fat by the time you eat this. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. No problem. <laughs> Okay, cool. So, uh, what about drinks? Do you have any like cultural, traditional drinks from your town? No, the same cola, same yours, the same mm. yani. Okay, okay, do you have like some special Iraqi tea? tea? The tea. Oh, we tea. have the tea. Yeah, let's talk about tea. Every every time you should drink tea. Morning, tea. evening. Ah, that's we should. Okay, drink. are you a fan of tea? Do you like drinking tea, or you like? Mm, not exactly. Not exactly. Like we go for uh, coffee. Coffee. Like we call it Arab mm. coffee. It's okay. very bitter okay. and very black. Okay. And you can't actually have one glass oh, of coffee. Yeah, it's like very we strong, add. Yeah, we add mm -hmm. like just a very bit. few. Just a little bit. Yeah, a little but bit. But do you drink it with sugar or will you just drink it without? No, sugar? it's super bitter. Even if you put sugar, it makes no difference. No, it no. makes no wow. difference. Yeah. Okay. This is why we all we like all times we we mm. want to serve. Dates afterwards. Ah, okay. So, do you drink this coffee every day, or you have special no. days? No, we have a special you days when mm -hmm. drink this coffee. Mm -hmm. Special when you have someone have it, someone die. You should this to ah, feeling okay. about his what he ah, feels. Ah, okay. It's yeah. like the like the pain. Yes, you should about the, the pain for him. Ah, okay, you're mm -hmm. feeling the bitterness. Yeah. So uh, let's talk about um, the natural part of Iraq. Uh, I've heard that Iraq has got two rivers. Mm -hmm. So. Can you tell me one of those rivers? Yes. He's going to tell me the other river. Yes, we okay. have a river in the for my city, it's called Dijla, you name it. Dijla? Yes. Okay. And you? Uh, Euphrates. Euphrates. Euphrates, okay. Yes. Um, so, these rivers, uh, do people uh, like mainly go there for just seeing the river or it's only just for like agriculture or other stuff? Is it like a touristic site? Euphrates could mm -hmm. be considered as a tourist mm -hmm. attraction mm -hmm. uh, center or place. Mm -hmm because it has that uh, old uh, traditional place called okay. uh, the mm -hmm. Noriaz, mm -hmm. uh, water wheels. Mm -hmm. So it's very ancient and okay. people so far use it. Uh, what about the Tigris River? Tigris River. Tigris. Tigris. 
Ah, okay, Tigris, right? Tigris, Tigris. Tigris, Tigris. 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 Okay, I'm just gonna call it Tigris. I hope I don't get in trouble with the people yeah. from Iraq. They're gonna be like, you're messing up our river. <laughs> it's called Tigris, Tigris. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Iraq has got a lot of rich history. It's, yeah. It's, it's considered the cradle of civilization yeah. because almost all of the things that we use today came from Iraq. Mm -hmm. Writing, uh, yeah. you know, this the whole system that we're using these days, mm -hmm. it, it emerged in, um, uh, in uh, Iraq. Um, let's talk about the historical sites. What other important historical sites do you have my now state. that people can visit now that are from like many, many years ago? We have actually my country, we have a Malouia. Mm -hmm. It's a tower. It comes okay. to this. Uh, it's historical for the age of Abbasian, I guess. Yes. Yeah. This is the name, this okay. is the real name. So you should visit this place because when you up this tower, mm -hmm. you will see all my city. You'll oh, okay. see everything. You'll see the rivers. You mm -hmm. see the people. You see the house. All mm -hmm. amazing. Oh, okay, great. Mm -hmm. um, what's your favorite historical place to visit in Iraq? Well, uh, I I would go with Babylon City, mm -hmm. and my favorite uh, historical spot mm -hmm. is uh, Zakura Castle. Okay, I love it. It is very attractive and very famous and very very old. Uh, what other historical sites do you know? Maybe you've never gone there, but you just know them, like uh, yes, in Iraq. Yes, I know. I have about the, the castle of Erbil. We okay. called it Haulir. All right. It's th this uh, this castle. Imagine about the old city for Erbil. Uh, okay. Yes, okay. you should visit. And we have a Qashla. The same, the same things about the tower of uh, for my city, mm -hmm. but it's small. So, uh, do you know how to cook? Yeah. Your, your traditional food. Yes. I don't know how to cook it, but okay. It's which this. foods can you cook? Like you can say, like I am the master of cooking this rice. Rice. Yeah. <laughs> I can also cook rice, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not even a master. Yeah. My rice is horrible, but maybe yours is better. But my rice is yeah, horrible. Yeah, you should try it one day. Uh, okay, so okay, we'll try your rice. So um, I know, like Iraq can get hot sometimes, but in yeah. summer, how hot can it get? Like how many degrees? Can it get in summer when it's like very very hot? We have uh, in Erbil mm -hmm. in the north. We have uh, more than uh, I guess thirty to uh, thirty-five. Thirty to thirty-five. Yes. Okay. And in, in Baghdad, mm -hmm. it's around it. It's about forty forty-five. Okay. In Basra, sixty. Sixty degrees. <laughs> yes. Wow, it's 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 burning outside. Yes. You can't even go outside. Yes. You'll. You can just. Uh, you know, you'll like die about this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some but people even fry eggs on summer hot days. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. The yeah. Okay. So you can save on electricity and gas. <laughs> yeah. Just go outside and just. Fry yes, we not do them. anything. Okay, cool, cool, cool. <laughs> uh, what do you like to do when you're in uh, Iraq? Uh, just hanging out with your friends. What do you do? Do you go visit places? Do you mm -hmm. go? Uh, what do you usually do? when you visit uh, Iraq? Uh, I absolutely go to visit the marshes mm -hmm. in the south of Iraq. Mm -hmm. It is very historic, it is very rich and very calming and beautiful. Okay. Uh, you can see how traditional people uh, uh, live in the marshes and they are living here for like thousands of years and so far they do. Okay, so um, do you have any f uh, songs that if someone plays it, everyone from Iraq knows that song? Do you have like a very popular song that if you just play it, People from Morocco will be like, I know this song. Oh, yes. Well, yes. Uh, it is called Zghaira Chinit. Mm -hmm. It is very popular. <laughs> Everybody in Iraq knows it. Can you sing it just a little bit? Well, my voice is not like <laughs> <I'm> singing. <laughs> we can Maybe edit my... the voice. We can, <laughs> we can put some auto tune and we can make you sound very good. Zghaira Chinit, winter Zghaira. Oh, oh, have wait, wait, wait. <laughs> come on! No. We were going very well. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. Like uh, we got an idea of the song. Okay, so uh, I've I've read somewhere that you've got this uh, traditional dance. I think. I th yes. I don't, I don't know if I can. Uh, yes. Is it called hatch hatch Debcha. Debcha or Chobi. Debcha. Right? Yes. Okay. But we called Chobi in real name. Okay. Yes. Um. Is it like uh, popular everywhere or like only like in the small cities people know how to do it? Actually popular in some cities like mm -hmm. uh, my friend Nambar from me, okay. uh, Baghdad but all Iraqi people should know this Okay. because it's traditional. Okay. You should know it. But in, in, uh, in Kurdistan, mm -hmm. in Erbil, we have mm -hmm. another thing. The same but not in the same way, the same technique. Ah, okay, just mm -hmm. like a, a bit different. Yes. Okay. I've read also that there is a traditional music that is called Maqam. Mm -hmm. It's like a mixture of, I think, poetry and music. Yes, we have a lot of. Uh, do you do you have do you know like some popular kind of 
artists who make this kind of music? All the, all the old artists mm -hmm. you do this maqam. Ah, okay, so mm -hmm. it's like an old type of mm -hmm. music, right? You should, should know this, you should know. Okay, mm -hmm. but now uh, people are no longer making this type of uh -uh. music. Not, right? not all, all the artists. Uh, and, and you, who's your favorite uh, Iraqi artist? Uh, generally, uh, the one who plays Oud. Oh. Uh, I Nasir Shamma. Yes, Nasir Shamma. Nasir Shamma okay. okay. is my favorite. Okay. Guitar. So um, there, there are two mountains, I think, two big mountains in Iraq. Mm -hmm. uh, what are their names? Is it a, a series of mountains or just uh, a mountain? I don't know. I just so read like there are two lot. big I mountains. Ta, I don't know if, if I'm saying it correctly. Uh, ta, ta, Taurus or Taurus? Hasarost. Okay. Ah, Hasarost. And uh, <laughs> there's the other one called. Uh, I, don't, I, I forgot it. Me too. Uh, I, I saw that there is one mountain called I think Z Zagros. Zagros. Yes. Yeah. Zagros. Have you ever gone there before? No. No. Just read it in the geography. Oh, okay. Mm. Do you like uh, mountain hiking? This kind of thing. Like I like, but I didn't do it right now. Okay, you haven't done. Well, it's not very popular in Iraq mm. because uh, it, it is normally hot and there okay. is yeah, like you know, it's not a forest and you go visit it and then you go camping. It's really hot and oh, really mm, like harsh cold. weather. Oh, okay. So okay. people don't really go there. Let's say it's my first time in Iraq. I meet you in Iraq and I'm saying, hey, um, it's my first time in Iraq. Um, show me around. Show me the cool places. Show me where to go. Show me what you know, like the cool things to do. Where would you take me? Which place in Iraq would you take me? Oh, well, it depends on uh, what you really want to see. Is the modern part of Iraq or the old history of Iraq? So okay, let's say I want to see like the old part of Iraq. Oh, would you take I'll me? probably take you first to Babylon. Mm -hmm. It is the it is the uh, mm -hmm. the first. Uh, like historical uh, and tourist attraction place mm -hmm. and then I'll take you to Ishtar and Ishtar gate okay. and then I'll take you to the uh, the marshes okay. and some parts of uh, here and there uh, okay. uh, there are a lot mm -hmm. of old uh, places you can visit okay Maybe. so um, about food uh, which food do you think every new person to Iraq should try which food do you think every person who comes to Iraq should try this food which food do you think uh, everyone should try probably dolma dolma yeah okay awesome uh, do you have anything to uh, say to someone who wants to come to Baghdad any words that you want to say to people to invite them to Baghdad to invite come them to Iraq? come to us. all right <laughs> <laughs> plain and simple <laughs> okay that's you great. should visit our country by the definitely, definitely yes you should if, if you are going to help because you'll know you, sh you will see a lot of people so kind they help you Okay, that's mm -hmm. great.